What about uh, email? Yeah. Yeah. You know, letters. Letters. You want to you want to store letters on a computer? Might be handy. Okay. So, uh, how would you store letters on a computer? <coughs> yes. Through numbers. Through numbers. How would you do that? Through the binary code. Through the binary code. Yep. So, how would you how do you store uh, letters as numbers? Um. Well, each number would um each letter would have a certain code, and every time you type that key, it would um. It would use that code to put the number on the screen. It's a good idea. What's your name? Nick. Nick. All right. Uh, do you want to make up a code for us? Yeah. Like, uh, do you want to assign some some numbers to to, to letters of the alphabet? Um, okay. So. Uh, so so the letter A. What's that going to be? Thirty-six. Thirty-six. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've only got numbers uh, one to thirty-one, uh, zero to thirty-one. So let's make A one, right? <laughs> so B would be. And C would be. Three. Let's okay. time lapse. What uh, would be Z? Z would be. 26. Alright, so, uh, ladies and gentlemen, allow me to unveil the NIC code. Uh, this is the, uh, the standard NIC code for representing <laughs> numbers uh, on a computer. It's been used uh, for centuries. And uh, we've, we're all supremely grateful to NIC for inventing this code. So, uh, if I want to represent uh, the letter M, which is the first letter of my name. Uh, I'd like uh, to represent the letter M as a number, please. So that's, what number is that? 13, good. So let's have the number 13, please. So, the letter M, and this pen just broke. <coughs> Why'd you break it, man? So the letter M is, uh, can. Can you guys uh, call out w if you've got your card showing a 1 and if you haven't got your card showing a 0, please, starting with Nika. 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. Okay, so in terms of bits, my name starts with 01101. But, 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 what if uh, Harv is all the way down there uh, and he needs to get a message to me who uh, I'm all the way over here? Oh, it's like the internet. It is like the internet. Uh, does anyone does anyone know how the oh science noise? Ooh. Oh, there must be some science of Bruin. Science. <laughs> there's a there's a device in your house uh, that connects your computer to the internet. Does anyone know what it's called? Yes, uh, you're in the blue. Yes. Oh, the modem. The modem. Yes. Does uh, does anyone know what uh, modem stands for? Okay. Actually stands for modulator, demodulator, and in fact we're going to swap those around because we're going to do that the other way. But uh, if I just do some clever folding, do some clever folding. Look, I told you computer scientists like to make things small. So it's modem. Okay. So you're going to be the demodulator, and I'm going to be the modulator in this example. So uh, what a modulator is, is it turns uh, the ones and zeros into something else. Yes? Little things that... Little, little fairies that yeah, travel down the wires. <laughs> oh, the internet! She's on to us! <laughs> <laughs> Everybody cool. knows that fairies transport Almost. the internet. <laughs> Almost. Um, yes? Into signals. Into signals. Uh, there's a special type of signals uh, that it turns them into, actually. Um, what is your modem used to connect to the internet? A wire. A wire. What sort of wire? The phone wire. And what do we know about phones? They use, they use sound, alright? So, uh, so what a modulator does is it turns these ones and zeros into sound, and the demodulator turns them back into ones and zeros at the other end. How does it do that, Matt? How does it do that? Well, I vote we, should, we ask our science savvy audience. Science savvy audience. <laughs> Any advances on fairies? <laughs> uh, how, would you, how might you represent a zero or a one using sound? Yeah. Low and high pitch. Low and high pitch. I so a zero, mm. zero might be a low pitch, like beep. Yep. And one might be a high pitch, like beep. Like a fairy makes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just like that. Can we call them low and high pitch or <laughs> trolls and fairies? Trolls and fairies. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're having far too much fun. I'm having far too much fun thinking about fairies. <laughs> okay. So uh, the, the first character of the message that I'm going to send, all right, uh, is going to sound like this. So if I, do a, if I do a low note, okay, I want you to show a zero. 
And if I do a high note, I want you to show a one. All right, you ready for this? Okay. Starting. Yep. So, beep, 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 beep. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so what, what do we got there? Zero, one, zero, zero, zero. Uh, so what number is that? Eight. Eight, which is letter H. H. Received first letter of message. Okay, so the demodulator at the other end is working to turn those back into ones and zeros and turn that into a H. An H. Okay, so the next the next letter of my message. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, and so the number is nine. The letter is I. So the message is received I. second letter. All that to send hi. Yeah. You must not be on broadband. <laughs> <laughs> the internet is pretty slow if, uh, if you're just using beeps and feeds. Okay, I'll send you a message back. Okay. I've written it down so I wouldn't forget it. Harv's already modulated his message. Oh yeah, because I'm awesome. <laughs> okay, so, uh, first letter is beep, 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 beep. Okay, so there's two. See the speed? I'm on Telstra Clear. B, okay, right. Ready for next letter? Yes. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> so fast. Okay, what do we got? 25, which is? Y. Final letter. Final letter. Beep, 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 beep. Y. Or, yeah. troll, troll, fairy, troll, fairy. <laughs> cool. Which makes my message complete and fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, Harv and I have just had a... Um, what a we call it, conversation. A packet exchange <laughs> over the uh, over the live internet. That's fantastic. Wow. I think these guys have done a great job. Can we get them to sit down? <laughs> yes, yes we can. Give me your cards. Cool. Give me a hand. <laughs>